Hi there, my name is Sunil Yadav. I am going to talk about how we can install Node.js in Macbook M1. So I have done it uh, through the uh, NBM actually. So if you see what is NBM, NBM is like uh, you know uh, package manager. Like uh, you can you know switch uh, whatever version is very easily. So if you go over here right and let's see about okay. So NBM is a version manager actually. This is a version manager for Node.js designed to be installed per user and invoke per cell. NBM works on any post post six compliant cell. SS dash case data SS. Okay, all the support is supporting. So basically, it's like a version manager. Uh, we can do like a switch at particular you know version the way I am we am used like as SDK man, right? So that that is similar way uh, we are going to use this one. So first is how we can you know install um, uh, NBM. So the, the idea is if you go to like uh, brew dot sh and search uh, like NBM, then you will get this command. So if you try to click this command and run it, uh, please make sure you're running under Rosetta terminal mode. Okay. And um, if you don't know how to do that, I have already um, created video for it, so you can check uh, the list um, in, in my channel. Okay, so if you just do brew install right nbm, so it's going to be installed basically. So updating home brew, all those things, right? It's going to do that and then install it. Okay, so now we can see right, uh, it's already installed for me, so it's not going to install it again, or I can say reinstall nbm, right? So it's going to be reinstalled. So if I say nbm. Uh, minus b right so it's going to do this version so let me do reinstall okay so general so you can see all the steps so i'm going to say nbm reinstall nbm okay so it's going to download the things again and trying to you know reinstall okay the one more thing is right once installed please make sure copy this thing right copy this uh, thing to you know the dot zss file so if you see right i have copied the same content here under the as file so that if you uh, and also one more thing please create the folder so if you see the instruction right you should create nbm working directory if it does not exist like make directory you just copy paste this link and this link uh, generally i used uh, this content from the terminal like i copied this one i put it in my zss uh, file once you put it and um, try to you know close this window and try to see uh, nbm right minus b then you will see it's install and the version particular is going to show to you once we have in a path variable like all this uh, set of like nvm directory this one and we are setting these things in you know path okay once this is done then we are good to go with uh, node.js installation so if you follow the instruction right i will put this urls like in video description so how we can do that like uh, if we want to use install the node so generally we say nbm install node so the default stable version is going to install for us so i'm saying the nbm bm install node right so let me do command plus so that is more visible okay so it's going to pick the latest you know uh, the particular version uh, stable version if we can say nbm nbm right ls so it will say what version currently in used and uh, i am using it okay if you want to see like how many versions of level uh, in uh, remote uh, so we can say nbm ls uh, remote right so we will see all the versions right available uh, in the remote repository okay so it's showing all the version right one by one so once you done, uh, so it then we am going to run, run. So we will check like node version and uh, no npm version. Okay. So and then always new cell use the installation version, right? So if you follow these instructions, you will see you know, all the details here. Okay. How we can use? Is like npm install latest npm, right? So up to you. What version you want, you can switch it. Okay. So. Let me see it's finished hopefully. So if you see it's finished, I'm using latest version. So let's check the node version, right? Uh, what node version we have? So same version we have. Let me check as npm, right? Minus b. 
so this was an okay okay so this is also working perfectly fine so i i found this is really useful if you use nvm like version manager uh, it's really good to switch a particular node.js version okay so thank you uh, that's it from this session hope you like this uh, and you learn something new how to install node.js please subscribe my channel and share your feedback and press the bell icon so that you don't miss our upcoming videos. Thank you.